guys just a little message before the video begins today. I just wanted to say I definitely appreciate all the comments and all the love so much. I, it, it affects me on a daily level how much love you guys express to me and to us. And I hope you guys can feel the love that we have for you guys back. There's so many of you guys that make me laugh and cry and... Uh, you guys evoke so much emotion from me in the comments when I wake up in the morning and I'm doing comments and I'm reading them and I am laughing my butt off with you guys. Some of you guys are so witty, so sarcastic, so funny and I just love that and some of you guys are so sincere and so kind and so sweet and I just love that and it just makes such a huge difference to our lives, to our day and I couldn't ask for a better day fam. And I just wanted to say that. And I have one wish for all of you guys is to feel the love that I felt after I cantered um, just one time. Just from one, just one time for you guys all to feel that amount of love. It is incredible. And I just wanted to say thank you. So that is it. Let's get on with the video. How you know you're late for breakfast when the horses are are making sounds. They're like, feed me! Feed me! Good morning, guys, and welcome. It's a musical chorus going on in there. Welcome to today's video! Every day holds the possibility of a miracle. All you have to do is wake up, go out there, and see what God has planned for you. But today, I challenge you to do one little change. Today, I challenge you to go out there and be you just for the first half an hour, just for the first half an hour of your day. If you're sassy and you know it, own it. If you're grouchy and you know it, just own it. If you are smart and you know it, just be smart. If you are sarcastic and you know it, be sarcastic just for just for one hour today, just for one hour. And if you go into a, to an environment and you be yourself and somebody laughs at something that you say, own it, laugh with them. Don't be upset that they're laughing at you for being yourself, laugh with them. Because if somebody thinks that you're funny, own it. If somebody thinks that you're rude, own it. Just be yourself. Because when you're yourself, something magical happens. It's the magic of life. When you be yourself, no matter what, no matter what environment you're in, no what matter if you fit or not, something magical happens and you appear confident. Even if you're not confident, if you act yourself and just be yourself and don't care about if you fit or not, but you just be yourself, people think you're confident and there's nothing more appealing in life than a confident person. So that is my challenge to all of you guys today. Go out there and for one hour this morning, own who you are. If you meet a grouchy woman at the doctor's office, wow her with your sense of humor. If you meet a grouchy mean teacher, wow him with your um, sarcasm. Just be you. And if somebody doesn't like it, who cares? Because you're just doing you. And there's nothing wrong with that. Just do it. Just try it. I dare you. So yeah, our uh, field is a mud pit. It's a mud pit. Terrible, terrible, horrible mud pit. Which is fine, because the horses can stay in here or they can choose to go out in the mud pit. But it's not fine because these poor horses, the poise, cannot go out. They do not have a choice. I have no place to put them with a shelter and I do not want to put them out in the rain. It's freezing cold today. Are you licking the bars? Are you licking the bars? Own it. If you are a bar licker, own it. Don't be embarrassed to lick the bars. Don't stop licking the bars because people are looking at you. Do not stop licking the bars. What are you doing? Why are you licking the bars? If you want to roll in the mud and look all dirty and not brush your hair, own it. Right? Because we love you, even with your hair dirty, your fur dirty, and your hair not brushed. If you're gorgeous, own it. Right, Storm? If you're slow and take your time, own it. It is so raining. It is so raining. It I'm frozen. When I walked down here, it was not raining. So I'm what's frozen. What is happening today, frozen girl? Frozen. What's happening in the frozen? 
Riding. We're riding. We have lessons today. Are we driving in? No. Oh Fiona is coming here to the frozen mud pit day by day farm. Oh, I'm cold. Snuggle me. Gabby's been wearing her winter coat. I've been taken to calling Sophia sheep girl. <laughs> own it, sister. If you're afraid of a sheep, own it. Well, I like that one person. Yeah, somebody said, Sophia, sheep are scary. <laughs> anyway, yesterday you may have saw that while we were away, the horses were playing and they broke out of the out of the out of the arena and they opened some bags of treats. Gracie, I'm sure. All right, Sophie, what do you aspire in your lesson today for? What do you aspire Riding for? Storm and canter. You want to ride Storm and Canter? Open sore. Oh, he's probably not sore now. He's sore. What do you aspire for in your lesson today? What is your dream? What do you hope I, to achieve? I wanted to jump high today, but I'm not going to. Why? Because our arena sucks. We'll be grateful we have an arena. Never know what can happen. Just put it out there. I want to jump high today and maybe it could happen. I think you're riding Finn and jumping Finn and I think Finn's ready to go up a level. There's your mini. All right, somebody needs to go up there and throw me hay. I've got no hay for yeah, these guys. Yeah, why did you do that? I know. I know, I didn't, I, I. Failed again? I failed again. I let her out too soon. Well, everybody was feeling white. But did you see that? She looked outside and was like, it is raining and wet and I'm not going out there. Give me my food here, please. <laughs> we have fluffy ears, we need to trim them. Ooh. He has fluffy ears. One more show. We have, a, we have one, we have one more show. We have one more show. It's craziness to think that we have one more show. without Sam here. I swear he always knows what I'm talking about him. Always. Anyway, so um, uh, he worked so hard today in the barn. It took for the, forever because Fiona's coming. It has to be nicer than normal. Really? So, yeah. I was jumping Ruby. Yeah, you were jumping Ruby. What I were you was doing? I watching Ruby and yeah. at the end I was playing. Yeah, so this girl did most of the work and at least they admit it. But anyway, you know, you we... You finish. I was playing that I was still at the horse. And I had a very abusive runner, and I was a dressage, dressage queen. Wow. <gasps> That's the story of you guys. What a horrible, like, abusive runner. But anyway, okay. When we were walking up to the house, the girls are like, oh, I'm so hungry, but you know what I'm craving? Because I wore them a lot. And then, year. yeah. They're the warmest things ever, though. Follow along with the conversation, sister. And, and, I was talking. And I am wearing these, this one. This I got note gloves, because I'm pouring sweat, because I did so much work. Anyway, Cinderella, that's me. Anyway, so uh, the idea to go to the grocery store before school, before riding lessons, before everything, is born by the fact that Gabby's craving what? I want um, that pasta stuff. She wants pasta for breakfast. Well, we what were you that. craving? No, uh, it's I want, the, um, I want onion and it's the chives and something. Sour cream and chives. Okay. Sour cream and chives. And it's we'll show noodles, them. We'll show and them. It's the best we'll thing ever. Them. Okay, ice cream. Yeah, we're not having ice and, cream. And breakfast. a veggie tray. And a veggie tray. So that's and what we're gonna no, do. No, a meat we, tray, not a veggie tray. We're veggie gonna tray. break a out. Meat tray and meat tray. Yeah, let's go, guys. Let's just go shopping. Woo! Come on, let's go. I need to grab something from down at the barn. Down at the barn? What? 
my horse. I need to pack him up and get you up on town yeah, to you, the grocery store. You can ride to the grocery store, huh? Yeah, but he won't like me. No, he would not like you. I actually want to. I could barely. Finally, Gabby's fast. Look, she's like, we're going for food. I'm starving. The horses are like, take me with you. You missed it. He was trotting. Yeah, you, we missed it. He was trotting beautifully. No, I saw. One day, my kids are going to grow up and they're going to be like, yeah, my mom took us to the grocery store in the middle of school. I'm like the cool mom, you guys. It's called before school. Before school. We're all wearing the same shoes. Hopefully, I have my bank card. I have my phone. But I don't have it. Oh. What are we getting? I'm not gonna eat anything too. Those are fresh. Oh my god. You got cheese. <laughs> Let's get this for the barn. Let's get this for the barn. Licorice. No. Licorice. No. No. I got this. It has Tootsie Rolls in it. No way. Tootsie Nobody rolls? eats Tootsie Rolls, and, Gabby. And, and the... Godsuppers. Nobody eats this candy. That's crap. No, those are not good. Let's get this. $7.99. Okay, but... Or that one. Yes. It's got chocolate and candy. No. Which I one? this one. <gasps> or that one. Oh, yeah. Look at if we got this, we can make caramel apples. Whoa. There was something that I had on my list that I needed to go to the grocery store for. Uh, I cannot remember what it is. Cannot remember to save my life. Guys, if you're too scared to ask something, then just ask. Yeah. Just do it. Yeah, because Sophie was afraid yourself. that I would say no. Steal it. Steal it from we the are not stealers. In the car. We are not hitters oh, and we are not stealers. Can I get this no. one? Oh, yeah, get that instead of tea. Oh, I'm getting tea. Um, look at this is juice is only two ninety nine. Can I get two? Yeah. Accidentally ended up in the drink and pop aisle. Oh, no, no. 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 Snowberry is the best flavor of peach tea. Don't get peach. What? I've tried peach. It tastes horrible. Snowberry is the best. Sometimes you just gotta spend $75 on a breakfast run. Do it, you guys. You will never forget the time Comes here that you just spent three an days. amazing minute with your kids shopping for a breakfast binge. It was so fun. Was it fun? No. Yeah, man, I love that. I just want to breakfast binge every day. I don't know what it means, but there's a smile upon your face. And I see something shimmering in your eyes. And they say if you want to glimpse the future, you need space.
<laughs> oh my god. Where what is it? Oh. I thought the whole thing was a bug. Sorry for all you guys who love bugs. Uh, they're gross and disgusting. Who would like them? Every life has value until it bites me. Once it bites me, yeah, there's no value there. Like, sorry. Anyway, if you want to message me, like, I'm at my other lesson. Where are you close to by your house? I'll be there. I'm like, ah! She's going to be here. Get down there. But we did bring special fun food that we already broke into. It's 45. There's probably 25 left. Just joking. Brought some pop. But more importantly, I brought this cheese bread. It was oh, like more importantly, she brought chocolate. Yeah. Why did you open it from the bottom? Because I what rolled. Kind of That's sick the monster. Own are it. You? Own it, sister. I'm a sick monster. Deal with it. Uh, so basically, these were the best thing I ate too. Why does it say 45 fun treats? It should say 45 delicious. good or delicious yeah. treats. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Come on. Get grooming. Oh. So, whoops. Yeah. This is our empty fridge. But now. It's got a supplement, an empty water bottle. Put it back. Put it back. A pepperoni stick and some pop. I dare you to eat this. No, come on, let's go. You're riding Finn, but if Fiona comes and says, hey, you're not riding Finn, then you won't be riding Finn. I so want to know. Oh salvage. Well, I don't know. We're, we're, you're riding your, well, who do you think you're riding? Let me ask her. Um, you, yeah, cause, okay. You're probably riding your own horses because you're getting ready for a show. Oh, and for the show, guess what Fiona wants? Hi. Yeah. Hi, Minnie. Hi, girly. Whoa. Did you do that? Whoa. I don't know how you have the patience for her. She's a bratty little Minnie. <laughs> Such a brat. Oh, yeah, to tell off. I feel like Will Willow's kind of got a like old lady, grouchy old lady personality. Yeah, you do. She's like, get me the chocolate. <laughs> Where's Gracie? guys are so mean to her. So one thing that we didn't show you from yesterday is that the girls broke out that door. So big long story, they didn't uh, evade the fencing, they broke out the door and they were the only ones small enough to get out. And at some point, I wish I had a camera up, all of our horses were together. At some point, all five of them were hanging out together. I imagine it went badly because the minis escaped and Stella was with Storm and Finn. Yeah, like she just hung out with them and I think that once the snow comes and the frost and there's no grass in the field, she'll be able to go out there in the big field with the big horses and I'm really excited about that. When you look at me this way I find it hard to not give in guys an update on Stella so basically the vet said that she doesn't really need time off to put pads on her feet get the barrier to put pads on her feet and then see how she goes um, I'm nervous and I wanted to give her a little bit of time especially if it's a stone bruise then time's only gonna do good so our oh he missed it um, so our barrier is coming next week at the end of next week and he's gonna put pads on and that's like a good couple weeks like three weeks or so that she that she will have been off so um yeah i'm good with that i'm i'm good with that so when she gets the pads on then on my next lesson all i will haul her in and see how she's doing so the days became weeks it felt just like the night before you were slowly fading in my mind I was so completely gone, but now I'm sure You were some of the best of things to find
find it hard to not give in And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below